Always a treat to catch up with Stubby Clapp, the Cardinals' first base coach, who happens to be from Windsor, Ontario, which is about a four-hour drive away. But this is a homecoming for you, so what's it been like for you, Stubby? It's been nice. It's been nice to come home, be, be in the homeland, and uh, you know, just breathing in that clean Canadian air and uh, walking around the streets of Toronto and getting to enjoy the, getting to enjoy, enjoy Toronto again and uh, and all its little surroundings. Have you had a chance to catch up with uh, friends and family on the trip? Yeah, yeah. My uh, cousin Kelly and uh, his son Ty brought my dad up so he can come up and uh, see me, and uh, it's been nice to be able to catch up with them and get out and uh, beat the bushes with them and reminisce and do all that fun stuff. That's very cool. So your tie-in with Canadian baseball goes back, and you're a big piece of what they've done here. In terms of baseball, you were on the uh, Canadian Pan Am team, had a big hit where they ended up, I think, with a bronze medal, if memory serves. You played for Team Canada, World Baseball Classic, and the Olympics. Anything stand out about uh, what you're able to accomplish in that stretch? Just the teammates, the teammates and the coaches that, that we did it with. Uh, we, we've had so much fun, and, and I think all the way back to actually 1991 as a, uh, as a junior, we won the, we won the uh, Junior National Championship um, in uh, Brandon, Manitoba. And... Uh, Man, what a what a just a, a journey to be able to be a part of Baseball Canada and, and everything that we've done, you know, amongst all the guys. Uh, you know, you talk about the '99 uh, Pan Am Games in Winnipeg. Uh, we got the bronze there, and then uh, we moved on to uh, we played in the '04 Olympics, '08 Olympics, and then uh, played in all the WBCs. So it's a lot of good, a lot of good guys, a lot of good memories, a lot of great staff, and a lot of fun. You told me about when we first got here to Toronto, there were certain foods that I have to try, yeah. and I've done my best to try to, to facilitate that. So I had the, the poutine, except I didn't have the cheese curds. I just had it with the gravy, and, and you criticized me. You blasted me for it. So today, yeah. I went out and tried it again with the cheese curds. It is better. So that's my f full apology to Canadians once again that I had the poutine without the curds, but it is better with them. It's way better. It's way better with the cheese curds. That's what I survived on my first uh, my first year of college. I was in college in uh, um, in Montreal. I went to Vanier, Vanier College and Concordia University, and I used to go around to the around the corner to the Dépanneur, and I used to get a, a big dish of poutine. I survived on that. Too. That's a lot of calories. It, that got me through my first year of college, and, and I'll, I'll never forget it. Matter of fact, I think I've had four bowls since I've been here. Have you really? Oh, yeah. That's, that's, I, had, I, had put, I had breakfast poutine today for the first time. What's in there, eggs? It was, yeah, it was all kinds of stuff. It was good. You don't ask. It you just good. eat it. It was topped with hollandaise sauce. I know that much. Well, that's pretty good. <laughs> Is there anything else that I, before we leave town that I have to try? Cause there's have you had Tim Morton's coffee? I have. Okay. That is great coffee. I'll great coffee. That. Great coffee. Um, that's a staple. Um, have you had an arrow bar? No. What is that? That's a chocolate bar. It's got like little air air uh, pockets in it or whatever. Like Nestle's soft. Crunch. No, it's softer than that. Okay. All right. All right. It's arrow bar. I did have. Crunch. I did. I did have the. I did have the coffee. Coffee crisp. Crisp. I had that. Those are outstanding. So usually I buy, I get a box of those and bring them home to my kids. Like that's it's pretty good. They, yeah, they live for those. You got uh, Arrow Bars, Coffee Crisp. You got Caramel. Have you had, did you have Caramel? No, not yet. Okay, you got to have Caramel. I'll take you in. I'll, I'll get it for you so the clubby doesn't get mad at <laughs> okay. you. Okay. Um, ketchup chips. No, I'm not having those. You got to have ketchup chips. not having chips. them. Jim. Danny Mac liked them. He yeah. ate them on the – Danny Mac ate those on the air last night. Danny Mac, you're the man. <laughs> Ke ketchup chips or all dressed chips? All dressed. Someone told me that's vinegar and what is it? Uh, I'll be honest with you. I really don't know. It just tastes good. Okay, because someone told me I got to try those. And if they have, so here's the deal. Let's let's wrap this up, and then you take me in the clubhouse so I don't get in trouble and give me the things that I need to try. Okay? Absolutely. We're gonna do that. Stubby, you're the best. All right, let's go. All right, guys. Stubby clap.